Hey everyone, if you like my videos, please subscribe, leave a comment, visit my website, uh, connect somehow. Um, oh, you could also, you know, click the like button below. This is a really cool book I've had for a long, long time. It's published by Basic Health Publications, Inc. Uh, I paid, I don't know, 20 bucks for it or whatever. This is like, I think this is one of my books that I got like in my Barnes & Noble days. Uh, there was one really close to my house and I would just go there and spend a lot of time there and this is before I think the Amazon and internet really kind of picked up I used to just go there and get a lot of my stuff but this book is about what minerals no not minerals I'm sorry it's about amino acids uh, that's what I was thinking of um, amino acids and it covers all the main amino acid but it's really neat because if you have any questions about any amino acid and really want to understand how to use, let's say, arginine or histidine or proline or N-acetylcysteine or NAC, that you know, it goes uh, by in stores, uh, glycine, glutamine, alanine. What's interesting is when you read this book, you start understanding that like amino acids, when they're used in high doses just as amino acids, um, they work like drugs, essentially. They have very interesting properties. For example, arginine at high doses vasodilates, opens up your arteries. Um, you know, beta alanine has other properties. It does. Um, there's a couple different things I did not. I haven't been working with amino acids individually so much lately. But one of the things it does is it gets stored in the liver and breaks down into sugar when you need it. So it's great for endurance. Um, what else? N acetylcysteine at high doses raises. Uh, um, not glutathione, I think it is glutathione, yeah, it increases glutathione in the liver, which is one of the most hardcore um, antioxidants the body can make. So, this book is really neat, it covers everything. Another one, just for amino acid freaks out there, uh, one, connective tissue is basically composed, with, uh, composed of vitamin C, uh, proline, and lysine. Proline and lysine being two amino acids. When you increase that with the vitamin C, it stops um, placking in the arteries and stops the collagen from breaking down as fast. Now, of course, some conditions are actively breaking down, like autoimmune conditions and other type of situations. So it's not like the cure-all kind of a thing. But proline, lysine, and vitamin C will take you far in helping... Um, um, metastatic conditions and keeping the connective tissue and collagen very strong and stable for a long time. Um, I don't use so much amino acids in my work. I'm not necessarily opposed to it. There's also another uh, group of people that I've that I'm familiar with. I haven't worked with or anything, but I know about that they do work with addiction and they pump amino acids into the blood so that it can. Um, go into the brain and they use it for uh, withdrawal symptoms and it works great you know for all sorts of different withdrawal symptoms so the brain sometimes doesn't get some of these nutrients that it really needs and amino acids I mean come on they're like the building blocks for your 3d system which is your body right because you can navigate your space uh, and have mobility with that you know you're not just some kind of you know um, two-dimensional or mental process you're a body that's in um, a competitive space with other things like us like other three-dimensional things so you want to be built properly so amino acids are uh, really important now if, if you don't know much about amino acids let me just give you a little quick primer also um, which is I probably should have said this in the beginning of the video but whatever if you're watching then you get this part uh, Protein is constructed of individual amino acids. So it's like you get like, imagine like a big piece of wall with bricks, right? So like, let's say a big piece of wall is the protein where the individual bricks would be the amino acids. And uh, egg is probably one of the most efficiently absorbed um, uh, for, you know, sources of amino acids. But when certain f proteins or certain uh, protein sources that are vegetarian are combined, like hemp, rice and pea they become great sources uh, of protein that are very absorbable to the body um, I personally I do really well with animal protein very little 
amounts of animal protein, I feel very good, I feel very strong. But along with that, you want to be doing a ton of, you know, good quality green juices, salads, excuse me, things like that. Fruits, nuts, seeds. Um, but anyway, so one more thing is a lot of times people are having problems not because they're not eating enough protein. A lot of times that is the problem. They're not eating enough protein. Um, but especially two groups of people I've noticed. Uh, young women, because they're trying to like, uh, they have a certain lifestyle and they're trying to not eat and stay skinny and they miss meals and stuff and they're losing blood from their cycle. So that's one group. And then the other group is older people that aren't eating fibrous foods or eating enough protein because they can't afford it or their teeth are all jacked up. So, because they're missing teeth or they're in pain and it's a really sad situation, but that's how you get nourishment into the body and they just get sicker and sicker and lose more teeth because they're not getting the nutrients and they're having other health problems. But hydrochloric acid, HCL, if you see in the markets, a lot of times people think it's called HCI. No, it's called hydrochloric acid chlorine, CL. Um, you want to be getting that stuff and using maybe about 300, 200 to 400 milligrams plus, if you need it, to break down your protein. Not everyone needs it, but it might be a good idea if you're eating meat on a regular basis and you're probably over the age of 30. It'll save your own indigenous hydrochloric acid, which you can, your body can use for other things like infections and so forth. So enjoy your protein out there and build yourself.